friends, it's Kara here with Kinsley's Creative Palette, and it's Tuesday, which means, and it's the first Tuesday of the month, which means it's new project time. So excited, friends. So, I don't know if y'all saw, but last week, I designed and put on line, whoops, um, this template. Let me change the lighting real quick, see if I can make, there you go, um, this template. So, it's a truck with school supplies in the back. So that's our project for the month. It is $2.50 for the digital template on the website the entire month of August. And I do that so that maybe you will try something new, jump in and join me. Good morning, Beth. So good to see you. All right, so we have some business to get to before we get to our template this month. Um, and that is picking our winner from last month's sprinkles. So you can still sprinkle um, every month. We will have a new giveaway. So every single video that you sprinkle throughout the month gets you entered to win some type of prize. Last month, it was one of these blank door hangers. So you can paint it any colors you want. Um, it already has the lines on it. So you just, it's, I mean, it's like paint by numbers. So we're picking that winner today. And for this month, the prize that we are sending out, it'll be the first week in September, is this mini truck cutout. So this is like a, hello, Amy Lynn. Hello, Nicole. Girl, I can't wait to do this one either. So the mini truck, hi, Anne, is um, the size either for a porch leaner um, or you could put it on a wreath. You could give it to a teacher for their door. You can paint both sides. You can see I already painted this one white on the back. Um, you can paint both sides so they could turn it around and maybe have a Christmas truck with um, school supplies in it. I don't know. Whatever you want to do with it. But this will be our August prize for sprinkling. So I'm going to draw the winner live for July. Let me put that right there. That just helps me remember to remind y'all that um, that's the prize for the month. So let's get to cutting. I got this list right before I jumped on, so I apologize for not having it already cut. But who? Um, oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, who all is super excited about the school supply truck? Because that is what we're doing this month. And if y'all missed it last month oh you know what is it on my door oh last month we painted the beach scene Ooh. Oh, sorry I thought I had everything on my table today so if you missed it these videos are up on the Facebook page and you can go back and paint this um, that template is now full price it was half price all July so the new half price is the truck with school supplies. All right, so let me cut these. And today, if it's your first time joining us, t let us know that. Um, if not, if you are an oldie um, but goodie follower, I appreciate you so very much. If you're new and you've never put a door hanger template together, I'm going to show you how to do that today. For those of you who've already done it and are showing up for the um, drawing or just to hang out, thank you all so very, very much. And it looks like Facebook is actually showing me comments. Naomi, welcome. Thank you, Michelle, for sprinkling. Yes, Amy Lynn. And you know what I really love about the, um, the truck is I have it painted like 10 different ways and you don't have to cut a new one each time. You just flip it over and paint. Hey buddy. Um, eat some breakfast first. Um, so if you already have, you know, you can cut one and paint it twice. Missy, it's your first time too. Oh my gosh. Well, thank you all for sprinkling everybody who's sprinkled. And if it's your first time, I just want to give you a really big Kinsley's creative palette. Welcome and tell you that I am super excited to have you here and we are going to draw the winner. And then I'm going to show you how to assemble your $2 and 50 cent, which is the half price template of the month. And if you have not gotten it yet, um, if you, you know, have been waiting or you're like, I don't know, 
it's totally okay. You've got the entire month of August. Hello, Miss Belinda. Michelle, thank you. That's very, very sweet. Yes, I love it. Um, Amy Lynn says you cut out six and then you have the whole year if you do both sides. Now, Amy Lynn. So, I'm sure that you already have seen this, but in case you haven't, I even show you in one of my videos how to cut three at a time. So, two cuts, basically, and you could probably even cut four or five. Hello, Miss Connie. Hello, Miss Laura. Um, but I show you how to cut three at a time, so really um, two cuts, one sheet of wood, and you've got your door for the entire year. Seriously, how cool is that? Um, and um, if you make extra, you can make gifts for other people. Uh, and you can make one that, like I have one that's kind of spring but would take me into summer. It's got lots and lots of cute flowers on the back. Um, so you can always, oh, and then um, a sunflower truck. I have a sunflower truck, which will take me from summer to, you know, all the way into like Thanksgiving. Missy wants to know how do you buy a cutout? So you don't want to cut your own. So with Kinsley's Creative Palette, you have two options. I have videos showing you how to print the templates and cut your own, which I'm gonna show you today how to put your templates together. Or you can just go to my website and you can buy um, a template already done. And if you buy the truck, um, you can pick which truck you want and um, only one side is etched, but it will be etched with the lines already on it so it's like paint by number. So it's kind of like this, where it has the lines, um, but it's um, the truck version. So we've got all different kinds of um, blanks on there, and you can order those and have them shipped straight to your door. So, yes, I hope that that is helpful for you. And gosh, I didn't realize there were so many of these. This is awesome, man, I appreciate y'all. So if you're just joining me and you're like, what is she doing? We have a drawing once a month where I give away a blank or some type of physical prize. Uh, in this past month, I was giving away the lighthouse template. And so every single person that, that sprinkled um, a video in July was entered to win. Every single person that sprinkles a video in August is entered to win. So um, this video counts. So I do a video every Tuesday and every Thursday, as long as, you know, we're not on vacation and have a sick kid or something like that. So you have eight chances every month to enter to win. And this is what's really cool, is if you sprinkle it to more than one place, like let's say you're part of a group that does crafting and you're like, oh my goodness, they would love this. Sprinkle it in there and get an extra entry. Thank you so much. I don't know if that's Beth or Amy that is on right now, but thank you for posting that link for me. I greatly appreciate it. Oh, oh man. Okay, we're getting closer to the end. Okay, so I am dying to know because I know there's moms and grandmas watching me right now. Um, are y'all okay with the whole school thing? I mean, I know none of us are really okay, but like, have you made your decision and are you at peace with it? And are you still praying over it? Um, Cause I am praying for all of these moms, all of you, all of, oh, praying for me to make the decision that's best for their kiddos. Um, and if you have a mom in your life that is making that decision, uh, oh, thank you, Kathy. Kathy, I was feeling like it was kind of a hot mess. But thank you. Um, but if you have a woman in your life that is praying over that decision and is struggling, oh man, please pray for them. Because like at the end of the day, this is like, um, trying to think, how do I say this? It's, it's hard. <laughs> it's hard. It's a hard decision to make knowing that, you know, my kiddos' futures are going to be impacted. Um, one way or the other, positive, negative. How did I cut my truck that size? So, great question, Belinda. Um, Amy Lynn says your district is distance learning. Let me find that truck. I don't know where I put it. Under here? Okay, I don't know where I put the truck, but all of the digital templates 
come with one that is about the size of a sheet of paper, but then there's also, uh, you can use the, when you get your digital template, you can also make new templates of your own sizes. Now you're not allowed to distribute that, but for your personal use, um, I have a video where I can show you how to change the template size. So if you don't, if you get a template and you're like, oh, I need it in different sizes, you can, um, you can change that. So, all right. So I've been painting like a crazy woman right now. Oh, oh my gosh, Kimberly. Um, so this one is, I'm trying to see. So it's a little bit bigger than a sheet of paper. But the, so it'll be a, a little bit smaller if you use the template that comes um, in the download. Um, Cause you get the big one, you get this one, which we're gonna put together. But then you also get an ornament size and you get a letter size, which is good for wreath making. And so you can either cut from that or you can, um, you can redo your template. Thank y'all so much for sprinkling and okay. So I want to show you real quick before I show you how to put your template together. This is what we made in the virtual paint party last night. We painted, I painted this live. Um, I was so excited because I had some group members paint along with me and I want to show you. So this was the rendition that I did on Procreate. This was the lettering template and friends like this project came together so quickly. Um, we did a ghost last year that was like a quick, fun project, and I felt like when I was doing the cross that it was kind of the same um, as far as like time and how easy it was. So, some of our projects tend to be a little bit more labor intensive, and then others um, are not quite so labor intensive. Uh, so, anyway. All right, so here we go. We are gonna start assembling our template. When you print it, it's a PDF, you have to make sure that you read, oh, where am I, this stuff, okay? So it says right here, page, pages, or pages wide, two. So it's two pages wide. The orientation is landscape, okay? So that means that instead of printing it up and down, you're gonna tell your printer this is landscape. If you don't check the box that says landscape or portrait based on what it says here, it's not gonna line up. You're only gonna get a partial template. So one of the biggest questions that I get, I mean weekly, is Kara, my template's not lining up. Well, that's probably because on your printer, you have to make sure that you are using your the right orientation. So if I printed this in portrait, it's not gonna line up. It's not even all gonna be there. It's gonna cut it off, okay? So I do want to make you aware of that. I also wanna tell you that if you look right here at this image, if you after you print it, if you look really close, it shows you where all of the lines are. It's very faint and it's just white. So you'll be able to see, oh, I've got a joint there and a joint there. But a Essentially, we're putting together a big jigsaw puzzle. So I'm just gonna kind of lay all of this out. Now, let's see. I'm just gonna lay all of this out and tape it together. Um, oh, that dream catcher sounds gorgeous. I wanna see when you're finished. Okay, friends, so. I am, let's see, here we go. I'm just gonna get all these lines so that they match up or somewhat. There's gonna be a slight gap just because the, um, the PDF has, there's a border. So I kinda draw those back in if I need them. But I'm gonna start taping these together. So I've got my, okay, I feel like Blue's Clues. I've got my handy dandy notebook. No, I've got my handy dandy tape. Okay, so we got those two together, Give it a little bit more. Now, um, one of the tips that I will tell you is if you're gonna be using this template a lot, like let's say you make them to sell or for gifts and you're gonna be cutting a lot, I suggest you either buy some poster board at Dollar Tree, Walmart, and um, trace this onto poster board 
or not trace, like cut the outside of your template out on the poster board, or even better, if you can, just go ahead and print your template on cardstock, and when you put it together, it will have kind of a lip to it, so that it will um, be easier to trace. All right, so I'm just taping this all together. Now, if you ever get a template and you're like, oh, I don't really like that size, I wish it was bigger, I wish it was smaller, just message me and I will shoot you a video on how to change the size. And I probably need to, Amy, if you're watching, remind me to um, do a blog post on that video so that we have a quick way we can send it to our friends. All right, I'm gonna cut the bottom of this off. I don't need it. Underneath. Top. All right, so when I'm done, uh oh, when I'm done taping this all together. Works great taping or gluing the pick on the foam board too. Yes, Carrie, the only downside to that is if you um, don't have the picture in paper form anymore, like regular copy paper form, it's hard to transfer the design with graphic or graphic with graphite paper. So, one of the reasons that I like to um, use poster board and then uh, keep my paper template is when I go to set it on my wood, I can slide my graphite paper underneath there and I can trace. Okay, so what you would do at this point is you would cut all the way around. Now, I'm not going to bore you and do that, but I'm going to, you would just cut all the way around your template. And then you would get your wood, which if you're new and you need to know what wood to use, just let us know and we will direct you to a blog post that gives you that information. Okay, so I'm going to pretend like I cut all the way around it. Yes, I would love to see the video on adjusting the size. Okay, sounds good. Um, I, we will get that. Okay, but you see, you get the idea. You would cut all the way around your template. Then you would lay it onto your wood and you would trace around it. And then you would use your jigsaw or your scroll saw to cut. Now, I did say at the beginning of the video that if you are um, wanting to cut multiple, uh, I, I show you how to do that. And friends, uh, let me find a clip. Let me show you the clips that I found to be the best. Okay, so these right here, I get them at Harbor Freight, and these are the one inch spring clamps, and I open those up, I mean they're hard, I open those up and I clamp my wood in four places. Now, as you're cutting with your jigsaw, you have to adjust those clamps, but these right here make cutting multiple signs at once so much easier. All right. It's time. So friends, we've assembled our template. I will put the video up showing you um, how to resize your template. And then, uh, and like I said, any, any template you buy from me comes with a JPEG image that you can use to resize. All right, it's time to pick our winner. Now, if I announce your name, I'm gonna need you to direct message me on the page and send me your address. Okay. Woo! All right. I feel like my kids should be in here drawing, but it's so quiet. I'm not going to get them. All right. So here we go. Oh, I see who it is. Ah! It's Amy Lynn. Amy Lynn Lawson. Congratulations. Um, Shirley. 
great um, question. It's not in the it's not in Kajabi yet, but it's on the Facebook page or, or in the group. I'm sorry, in the in the private group. So you can watch it there. Um, and then we're downloading it today and processing it and getting it up into the library. So it's there for you. Shirley just asked about, she's a virtual paint party member and she wanted to know where she can view the cross video. And um, so that's what I was telling her. So Amy Lynn, you won. Thank you for sprinkling. Guys, if you would like to be the winner for next month, um, so we'll draw that at the beginning of September and it's for a mini truck. Um, all you have to do is sprinkle the video. Sprinkle, 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 sprinkle. Any video in the month of August of mine that you sprinkle enters you to win this, okay? So, thank y'all for joining me. Next week, you will know. Um, Cindy asked, does she need a, spe a specific program to receive the templates and print them out. No, ma'am, you don't. Adobe Photoshop, or not, I'm sorry, forgive me. Adobe PDF, which as long as you can open a PDF, which I've never had a computer that couldn't, as long as you can open a PDF, um, you just open it up and print it. So no, you don't have to have a special program. Yay, Amy, send me your, send me your, met, or your, um, Sorry, your address, and I'll get this in the mail to you. And congratulations, and friends, sprinkle for entries to win this little truck, which would be great on your porch leaner or on a wreath. So, thank y'all so much. I hope y'all have a fabulous day. And next, well, on Thursday, I'll be back with Creative Tip Thursday. Between now and next Tuesday, cut your sign and draw your your stuff on it. Use your graphite paper if you need to. Put it underneath and draw all of your lines and we can paint together next week. So next week, just so you know the schedule, next Tuesday I will be coming live to paint all the base coating and like all the colors. And then the week after I will be live showing you um, how to accent it and make it really pop. So hope you all have a fabulous day again. All of you who ended up in this bucket, I, I appreciate you so very much. Um, and you're welcome to keep sprinkling and win every month as far as, <laughs> as far as I'm concerned. I appreciate it so much. So have a fabulous day, and I will talk to you guys on Thursday. Bye, friends.